All right, welcome to Structures. We're going to do a little exercise. I've got a presentation for load-bearing walls, getting some beam sizes, and using some span tables. All right, on-site alterations for a job uh, out of Jaroa through a friend that I know. Client brief was remove existing window and door to take out wall and install load-bearing wall, load-bearing beam, sorry, to allow for 4.3 by 207 actual door size panel sliding door. You can see the guys started, they did this in one day, starting to take off the uh, architraves around the windows and doors. The class activity is going to be uh, refer online, research your span tables, and complete the quiz after viewing this video. So you can see the guys have taken off the cladding and the plasterboard or internal linings. They've acro propped to keep the actual load of the roof above, it was a truss roof. Uh, they had some engineered details that they could get five acro props across to support that. See the photos of them completing it, taking it out. And the actual beam that they used for this instance was a glue lamb one. So they put it in, propped it up to get it in position, and then they just fitted it out with the stud walls to either side. You can see on the right side here, they've just included it a bit bigger, just so it could fit the uh, 4.3 size in. And it's just got the one stud on that side there for the moment. Had to suit a 4.3 metre panel sliding door. Continuation there. Just giving you a bit of a visual. Completed job before they put the window actual sliding door in. We have the quotation from Hanlon. I've taken the main details out, but we have a panel sliding door 207A by 4.3 uh, fixed on the two ends and sliding in, in, this, in the middle. And here is a photo of the boys putting that in. Looks fantastic. Finish project, finish the cladding around the external, get the linings in and finish off with the architraves. So class activity is we want you after this watching this video to follow the quiz. Questions may refer to different styles of beams that can be used. So there will be three separate questions and they're going to relate to your Australian Standard 1684 table A24, your glue lamb span tables, uh, which is for upper story lintels, uh, tile roof that is for N3 and a structural steel in housing one steel span tables for seeing if we could possibly put a steel beam in. Alright, so we'll give that a go. Thanks guys.